We are here freezing our butts off at the Santa Monica Stairs. You never know what's gonna be like this close to the ocean. Um, I am here today with Whitney. You guys might know her from Instagram. Hello, what's your Instagram? at Whitney Johns. Right here. Hey. Underneath, we're gonna put it. On. We, we are cold. We are cold. We actually went to high school together. Boise, Idaho for life. Represent. Idaho Centennial. Do you remember Centennial's cheer, like fight song? Oh yeah. No. <laughs> Do you? Yes. <laughs> what is of it? Centennial High, <laughs> we long will cherish. Oh, okay. Yeah, like that one. I don't yeah, remember like yeah. I don't remember like our fight song. Did we have a fight song? Like that was just the one. That I was just our remember alma. We were the Patriots. Yes, we were. Right? CHS. <laughs> They're garbage now. Anyhow, <laughs> we are here. Honestly, people have been asking me. I hate when people say that. People have been asking me. Yeah, I'm sure they have. <laughs> no, but really, we're out here. We're gonna do a pretty much a hit workout. We're at the stairs, we're gonna do a lot of glute stuff. So, Whitney is probably more qualified to talk about glutes than I am because <laughs> the girl has, the how peach. do you say it? How do you say it? The, pe the okay. Idaho potato. There we go. <laughs> is, that, is that your thing? That's what you should do right now. The potato I plan. Rebrand. Instead of the peach plan, the potato <laughs> plan. I love it. They're like, ew, lumpy potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny though, Maybe the other not. day I was like legit like, the kid's like, where are you from? I'm like, oh, I know. He's like, oh, I love potatoes. Like, <laughs> You're really? like, thanks. Yeah. Uh, Never heard that one before. Seriously. So. Idaho? No, Utah. Utah! <laughs> Baker's probably never heard that one, have you, buddy? I heard the last one. You did? <laughs> Not the first one. Idaho, Utah? Yeah, yeah, you say okay. it all the time. All right. I say it all the time? Yeah. Oh. Because Utah. <laughs> <laughs> but we're here. So Santa Monica Stairs, they're legendary. They're hard. First off, we're gonna do some glute activation with this, and I'm following your lead today. Okay. I figure. Are you, you ready? You are the, you are the potato princess. So. Can you handle it? I don't know. We're gonna find out. All right. Well, we're gonna start with the mini band. Okay. Because you want to activate the glutes before you get moving. You train people on the regular. Yes. So I train clients one on one here in LA in Beverly yep. Hills, and then I have an app as well. And this we'll same, put that in, into the link too. The same mini band warm up that we're doing right now is in my app because this is like so essential. Let's do two more. So you want to go 12 reps, 12 to 15, up and out. So this kind of gets your abductors. yeah things are popping. Yeah, I'm getting old. Keep a nice engaged foot like you're doing. That's perfect because that makes a big difference in activating the glute fibers. Last three. Baker, my glutes are on fire. Two bro. and one. Now we're gonna go double band. So for this one, oh. you're gonna get down into a squatted stance, go up on the ball of one foot, and keep this other one stable. And you're gonna rotate out using oh, your I've never done this abductors. One. You feel that in your keep the shoulders back, everything. core tight. Look at those quads. It's like Quadzilla. <laughs> Last three. See, am I? My quads Funny. always start taking over and I need more glute activation. That's why I have a messed up back because so many years my back was doing the work that really my glutes should have been doing because they weren't firing. So I should have been doing this all the time. Do these like three times a week or every time you do any leg workout and you will start to really wake those up. I feel like I got a potato now. <laughs> a lumpy potato. All right, now up on the balls of both feet and open kind of feels like one of my clients calls it like the halfway twerk the like, halfway twerk not really oh. five four that little shake is good you want that two and one Woo. tap it out Goodness. <laughs> this is uh, my ass is gonna be so sore tomorrow I keep those hips square shoulders square squeeze pointing your toe or just keep it neutral foot flex okay yeah drive with the heel Make sure you're not swinging, you're really squeezing the glute. And I can tell you have done this a time or two. <laughs> She's got all the right keys. <laughs> I am a stickler about the mini band warm up. So do you train, how many guys to girls do you train? Like what it's is about 50, 50. Is it? Yeah. My new trainer, <laughs> Whitney. I'm getting fit with Whitney. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Last three, two, and one. Good. Now, side raise. So you're gonna go straight out, lateral. Oh, nice yeah. and tall and tight in the core as well. Keep 
feeling that. <laughs> I really am. More than I thought I would this early on in the workout. A lot of my guy clients are like, I don't want to do that Jane Fonda crap. <laughs> but then they do it and they're like, this is hard. Yeah. Like, this is no joke. All right, now, face the tree, <clears throat> square it off, square it off, and you're gonna kick around and back. So Ooh. Call this around the world. I'm learning, I'm learning some new stuff here. Yeah, this is a good one. Your glutes and your abductors. Fuel it with your breath. Or, whew, I'm kind of sore. Ooh. I'm feeling this. How one. often do you train glutes? Like, twice a few times a week. Depending on like how much I need to do. You know what I'm saying? Other side. Would you say, everyone has, you know, good body parts is, what is your best body part? Probably my glutes. Well, yeah, legs and glutes. Like I got good calves. You so do. There's Idaho potatoes. You do have good calves. I feel like it's like a, it was in the water. <laughs> everyone in Idaho has good, good calves. <laughs> I, would say, I would say good glutes, but my glutes, Right. Really? Nah. I was well, just gonna, I had a big quads butt, but. make up for everything. So you're gonna step forward and meet. So lateral. So meet those feet together. All the way together? Yes. So you can let that on. Whoa! Woo! Like a, two. This looks like a dance move. And a one. Nothing to see yeah. here. Just guy training glutes. <laughs> now reverse, same direction. There. Oh yeah, burning. Ooh. Last three. I popped me. I did not know you could do it like that. <laughs> oh. Okay. <sighs> Yowza. All right, now. We got side? Side, okay. last one. Cry walk. I'm gonna go this way because I don't want him staying on my glutes. <laughs> All right, stay low. And really open those knees. Forcing those knees wide? Yes. Yeah. Those knees are caving in, your glutes aren't activated. That's true. Oh. Oh. Two, one. Woo. You can always tap it out. Yeah, shake it out. And go back. Yikes. Yeah, you like it. <laughs> Good. We're done. Oh. Take these suckers off. <laughs> This is gonna be we are done with a pain that. in the ass, literally. <laughs> All right, guys, there's 1,571 stairs on this. I counted on the way down. There's a lot of stairs though, not that many. So you can do, when you're doing stair work, any number of ways. This one is just pretty much get to the top. You can do intervals where you sprint, walk, sprint. You can try to go all out and be a badass. If anyone has ever been to the Santa Monica stairs and you guys are watching this video and you have sprinted all the way up and you can prove it, I will send you something. Because I tried that the last time I was here and failed miserably. So we're gonna try it again today at the end, but pretty much we're gonna do different types of movements up this. We're gonna start off with fast feet, skipping stairs, side stuff, and uh, just go on from there. So we'll put below what we do for a workout here. And then uh, you guys, if you don't have like the Santa Monica stairs, that's absolutely fine. If you have, you know, a college, you know, stadium or even a high school football stadium, you can get a great workout from even doing like 20 stairs, 10 stairs. Like you just got to come back down more. So take this, kind of mold it to what you need to do. We're going to get after it right now. You ready for this? Oh, 
that's miserable. In my heart. It's hurting my heart. <laughs> I won. She got away. Oh. 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 Mama, the quads and glutes. Eyes look tired. Do I look high? <gasps> I'm not high. It's just a really tough workout. Even though we are really close to Venice, and we're kind of downwind. I'm kidding. Not everyone smokes weed in Venice, but I want to say thank you, Whitney. You killed that. Uh, thank you for having me. My, we're shaking. How are my glutes looking? Hey, you're looking pumped. Huh? Just do a little booty pop. Is that yeah. how you do it? I think yeah. we need to sign it off with like, when you're posting on Instagram, because I think you've mastered the booty pose. You know, let me just show you. Okay. So you gotta do like a little, you know. Oh, so one's on You gotta on the, stagger the feet. You gotta pop the hip back. Maybe do a little arch, extra arch in the that back. Isn't, oh, that's an arch and a half right there. You know, People are maybe throw up a flex to make it look more athletic. Is that it? Let's, let's see it. Here. Oh, I can see that. Do you have a good side it's and a bad side? It's all about the hip pop, you know, with it. The hip pop. Let's see yours. Arch <laughs> the back. Hip hop. <laughs> I think like you probably and, should take off the back though. It's like the bend and snap, you know what I'm saying? Like, 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 on. So this one's, this one's up here, arch. Mm -hmm. Well, like what? sink back in the hips. Oops, what? Mm -hmm. Trying to, I want to see it in one like motion just to click into oh. it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, if you guys want to see more of uh, Whitney doing that properly, not me, <laughs> check out her Instagram. It's right here. At Whitney Johns. Yeah, it's pretty simple. And check out her her plans. Honestly, I feel like glute activation, guys, we underestimate it because we see people doing a lot of band work, hip thrusters, and we go, oh, that's for the ladies. I'm not saying you need to, you know, train your glutes three times a week. Definitely one to two times for sure. Don't be afraid to use those bands. What would you tell a guy who's looking to, you know, mess around with a little glute activation? You know, it's it's all about functional strength. It's not just about your aesthetics. So it's not just about like getting a plump booty because that doesn't really matter for a lot of you guys. But it doesn't hurt either. Have a little booty pump. <laughs> <laughs> but it's the functional side of it. Strength. I like that. Yeah. And size. It's always good. Size matters. <laughs> size, so t the takeaway from this, size matters. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Like that, hit that like button for Whitney. But yeah, definitely check her stuff out. And uh, if you like this video, uh, like it and then let us know, you know, maybe what we should train next time. What do you guys want to see? Maybe next time we're in LA, we'll do something, okay? I'm out.